Welcome back. Tuanshe Kabiru, an inmate serving life sentence in Kirikiri Prison for murder, graduated um, third. Well, sorry, career at the third convocation of the National Open University of Nigeria in Lagos last week, Saturday. Now, Kabiru, who came into the company of the prison officials, um, was awarded a bachelor's degree in human resource management. The assistant controller general, Nigeria Prisons, Chooks Afejue, hailed the courage and dis displayed by the graduating inmates, saying he was the first to enroll and kickstart academic activities at the prison study center. This move, he said, will move to people, prove to people that the prison is not just a dumping ground, but a place where reforms and rehabilitation takes place. Now, what are your thoughts on this? It's your view, Lady Count. You can call us on 070-8066-8014. You can tweet to us at your view TVC. We'd like to hear your thoughts on this. All right. Um, I don't know why this is an issue because the, 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 the guy was sentenced to life imprisonment mm -hmm. and suddenly... He decided to get a degree, a bachelor's degree, and suddenly everybody's not talking about it. What's what? Yeah, because we're saying that with him being in prison, what's he going to use a bachelor's degree for? He's in life imprisonment, Abby. Yeah. And so you get a degree to do what? Eh, but what happens to self fulfillment? Like, you want to exactly. feel fulfilled. Oh, now I'm not a graduate. Eh, so I think you go to grave knowing that you're yeah, a you graduate. Why is an issue? Because he's in prison for murder. Now you shorten someone's life. Maybe that person wasn't a graduate. Now you are going to prison to go and get a degree. Chimake, we need to life. work on your repentance ability. <laughs> Seriously, or forgiveness this, ability. For, for, for forgiveness <laughs> ability, actually. This is a man who probably, well, I, I read his comments and he was saying, okay, he's praying that he feels tru truly sorry for what he, what he had done and that he, he, he prays that uh, the courts would, you know, look at his case again and probably shorten and give him a couple of years or, or so. So I feel this man has a dream. Of being and it, it's it's a being good, released of of being released and also being useful because I I encourage him for opening doors for prison uh, education in a, because you see most come not just in most convicts they will go to prison and they come out and they are useless They're they probably hiding. have spent thirty years and there is nothing doing and the society just you can't go back to school but obviously I see I wonder why people have an issue with it because this is somebody who is going to be in prison for the rest of his life mm -hmm. every day you wake up you do your chores as a prison inmate mm -hmm. you do all the stuff you're going to do there's nothing else to do mm -hmm. so now you're keeping yourself busy by studying doing exams, and getting a degree. You're keeping yourself busy. He could grow to become something, probably a prison senior prefect or something. <laughs> you, no, but seriously, we should not rule out chances. Mm. We shouldn't. Can I say something? Um, what's his name? Martin Luther King hmm. mm. went to prison. Mm. Nelson Mandela went, went to, to prison. prison. I just want to stop there. Oh, that's on job. Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do those two. We've, we've seen great invention. Did you know that toothbrushes was invented from a prison out of the, the requirement, the needs that, okay, they were using stockings mm -hmm. or something. Yeah, to wash I read teeth. that. And that was how they, they now thought about the invention of toothpaste, I mean, toothbrushes in, in the prison yards. Now, for me, mm. I have a problem with the man telling me that, okay, now that he has gotten a degree, he's hoping they will make his sentence lighter. No. It doesn't have to be in the prison. Some people are inside prisons, but their minds are not there. He can decide to start writing books. He can become a lecturer in prison. Mm -hmm. A prison is not supposed lecturer to be who? a... Inmates. Of course he's inmate. Okay. A prison is not supposed to be a place where people say, okay, your life has ended. Mm. We, we have seen good inventions come out from prisons. The reformation ground. The best uh, machine guns produced were produced from inmates. They gave, they gave them an opportunity to reproduce something. Now... Saying that he would get a lighter sentence, I don't agree with that. Mm. Because a lot of people will begin I... to commit murder, then they will mm. just go to the university because they have a degree now. They'll say, okay, take, you're free to go. But you can still remain in prison mm. and do positive things I in prison. I think, mm. so what do you think should be the next step for him? I mean, as a, as a, as a graduate now in prison. One thing that I've could... learned from this case, sorry to sort of like avoid your question, is that um, it's the person who's been killed or murdered, whose mm. everything has ended. Mm. you know so be careful if somebody points a gun at you please run away he can repent tomorrow and go to heaven he can go to prison and say because i now have a degree and i don't want to be i now want to be okay, that's because, a good point because we must we must also consider the victims um angles. exactly i think that's why it's an issue actually because if you went into prison for five years or ten years and they know that you're going to come out in ten years they want to reform you that's why they'll allow you go to mm. school. But for somebody who is in life imprisonment, you're not going anywhere. Okay. Let me take Gabriel's so Good morning, Gabriel. 
Uh, good morning. Morning, sir. Uh, concerning the issue on the ground, I want to let you know that a prisoner or a murderer in the sight of God, the Bible said that that person should be killed. Hmm? Notwithstanding. Which Bible is that one? About. Which so, God, so which God are we talking about? Which God? Our God in heaven. In oh. his commandment. Okay. He said, thou shalt not commit murder. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, you should not be uh -huh. killed. Oh, okay. So uh -huh. if, if that happened, that person should also be killed. Uh -huh. So I want to <laughs> say that that person... Okay, Gibu. Can be repented tomorrow. People read Bible steps. Yes, <laughs> and they... <laughs> All right, Gabriel. Thank you very much. I think you know, your, your Bible was printed I in was saying that. That was during the same Bible. And people just interpret it anyhow. In the Old Testament, when they say eye for an eye, Jesus came and corrected Grace. that. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so now I asked the question okay. about what should happen to the guy now. And I sort of like avoided the question. Mm. Well, I, 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 I think what should happen to the guy right now is he has his degree. Like Owa said, he could go on and be a tutor, be a source of encouragement. He could be there for life imprisonment, but he could tell other people that, look, there is hope. You can actually study. And when you leave this place in five years, mm. 10 years, you could make something so meaningful out of your life. he can be a mentor for those who have smaller mm -hmm. um, terms. terms. Ter yeah. yeah. They are. Or you can even, pro pro I was even thinking, promoting well, him to the book. United States of America, the prison. She goes to U.S. prison. To what? And become a, an something? inventor like a No, no wait, you see, on. the reason why you are talking about inventors mm. is because they had they were prisons abroad. Mm. If they're in prison in Nigeria, trust me, they won't invent Kiriki. too much. <laughs> <He's even laughs> so hopefully, we take his degree to the penitentiary in the U.S. Hopefully, he can invent something. Thank, thank Mariah, you. come on, be real. Somebody is a Nigerian um, offender in prison in a Nigerian prison. I'm you are not transferring him to he, US where he will go and enjoy as a murderer. He has a degree. I beg, I beg, I beg. Be real. I think Joe. I have a call. I'm not sure who's <laughs> it. Good morning, sir. Are you there? Onabe? Yeah. yeah. Go ahead. The fact that that guy has a degree doesn't change any situation. Because there are other guys who also have degrees, who, who are in prison. So I don't believe that ah. having a degree should, should change anything for him. That's an angle, okay. He can as well go and read for his uh, PhD. It doesn't matter. Okay. He's, a, he's, he's uh, serving okay. a life sentence. That's, That's it. true. I agree with That's you. That's true because... A lot of people inside there who are ha having degrees as well. Yes. So his own case should not be uh, true. different. We didn't think okay. about that because we're assuming that once you're a criminal, you, you have you, no you degree. Have degree. Exactly. But that's the assumption we're talking about. Really, he's not saying, listen, even those who have degrees like said, are in prison. But a larger percentage do not have degrees. A larger How do you know? A larger have percentage you of, uh, Well, there was this... Um, you don't know uh, that for a uh, fact. Well, I worked with uh, uh, Lamborghini and Stella Damasos when they wanted to dedicate books and libraries to... Yeah, and Stella Stella Damasos. The they have this project of dedicating Stella building Stella. libraries in, uh, in prison. So from there, I got to find out that a couple, most of them are not, you know, Lamborghini graduates. And, yeah, they are not mm -hmm. graduates. Mm -hmm. and if, okay, go on, go on. No, continue. <laughs> they're not they're graduates. Good, yeah, yeah. Well, they, they are not graduates. And sometimes even when they get into that prison, they're so full of depression because there's no book to read, no nothing. Most times what you read just goes va va voom and it's gone. Now? Go ahead now. Okay. See yet a man diligent in his work. Mm -hmm. We stand before kings and mm. not men. Mm. Mm. Amen. If the man, it's, not before me inside prison, Joseph was taken out from prison. Mm -hmm. Listen, you but must, if you are in the prison, became a prime and you're not, you not bringing solutions that Nigeria needs, Yes, it there's bring no way you, you remain inside that prison. Hmm. So I don't believe that. Even if you're a murderer. That, let me, let me, a murderer okay, let me pause you because we'll come back to you. You're taking going back to Bible. <laughs> Innocence, come on, are you there? Innocence. Hello? Hello, yes. Hello. Go ahead. Good morning. Morning. Yeah. Please, I want you to know that there's what is called a prerogative of mercy. Mm. Okay. The fact that he has been sentenced to life does not mean he does not have hope of living. Mm. Mm. It could change him for the better. Mm. So as long as he's in that prison and he can add value to the society, even the immediate environment of the prison, it's something that should be added. Yes. Even if he killed somebody, he's committed yes. of a murder. Yes, yes, even if he killed somebody. Mm. There are reasons. We don't, we, the Bible says we should not kill. Mm. For whatever reason, we mm. should not kill. Mm. But in our society today, there are so many reasons or factors. He might be innocent, 
He might not be. But that does not stop the fact that okay. he can add value to the All right. society. Point taken. Thank yeah, you very much. Yeah. Superior argument, actually. Yeah. Yeah. Because, I mean, David was actually yeah. a murderer. That's what I'm yeah. mm. That's superior argument. See, if he, in that prison, I'm not saying that, like, no, nobody should quote me wrong. I'm not saying that because now he has a degree, they should let him out. No. Mm. Remain in the prison. And be useful. And be valuable. Be an you know, become something worth value. Mm. Anything can happen. Something can, you know, a, a lot of people... But I think the most valid point I've heard this morning mm. is the fact that, listen, there are other graduates in the prison. No? Of course. Let's not even get it twisted because we're making it look as if this guy is now a graduate now things are going to be changed for him. Because there are yeah. a lot of guys out there too. They're not looking, they, they, they don't have jobs. <laughs> yeah. They're on roaming the are streets. On the same so, and they're not very creative either. Listen, we're so, on the same and page. There. It means that, no, this is a good thing. Because I was doing the research on prisons yesterday and I saw, mm. I think they have about four um, educational centers, open mm. universities that... They, they want to have across the, um, the, the country. country. Now, imagine if for the people, because majority were deprived of going to school. Now, imagine if this begins to happen and we see inventions, you know, they can be used, they can earn what money. What is your invention? Even, you know. Let me talk to Solomon. Good morning. <laughs> Solomon, are you there? What I am there. Good the morning. Boss does. Are you there? Hello. Go ahead. Yeah, good morning. Good morning. How are we doing today? Very well, Very thanks. Very well. All right. Well, I just have a little response I want to make or a contribution over what uh, we are discussing. Yeah. The, there is one young man that called initially. He was talking about, um, you know, he that killed and then he shall be killed as well. And I saw your faces. You are looking at how. Well, one of you also quoted from the scripture that the Old Testament says, um, an eye for an eye. It is scriptural, but still there is a place for mercy as far as God is concerned. In Revelation chapter 13, Revelation 13 verse 9 and 10, the Bible said, if any man have an ear, let him hear. Verse 10 now says, he that leads into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword must be killed with the sword. That is the word of God for you. That's the revelation. For that, as far as God is concerned. Okay. At the same time, God also is a God of mercy and compassion. If mercy can do anything, at will, how he wants it. The word of God explains us as well. He says, right. I will have mercy upon whom I will have mercy. Okay. Nobody was point taken. To divide, but Thank you, many, Solomon. I think I think I think the point I just want to point out that that part where he uh, quoted was during the Mosaic Law. That was practice of no, restitution. Like revelation, no. restitution, said revelation. Restitution. Restitution. Restitution during the Mosaic Law. That is it. In in yeah. in, in Revelation, that is the judgmental period. But as of right now, we are living under grace. We have tweets. Yes, we don't have it. a... I don't understand what Andrew <laughs> said, but... Fala Shadia Falabi says, says, if he likes, he should become a professor. He should not be released from there, because most of them end up committing bigger crimes if released. Benson David said, getting a degree doesn't erase the crime, does it? Though it pleads our sentiments to give him a benefit of doubt. Um, Victor Ovian says, the man has committed a crime, he should take the punishment, and the degree should be used in the prison. Yeah, one day, January 20th says, yes, people change. We don't know the circumstances that led to the murder, but he still moved on with his life. It's a good thing. And um, Francesca Glover says, he could be pardoned ultimately. As said by Uwa, prison is a place of reform. Humans mm. are in forgiving. Mm. One more. Oni Dali says, he could actually do a positive thing in prison with the knowledge he has required. He has acquired, yeah, which is what um, was argument is, but that's um, that's all we can take okay. on, the, on this um, topic. Topic, but I just hope that um, he actually makes good use of his new degree in prison. He in will. Prison. We are not I saying he should he come will. out of prison. <laughs> in prison. But people should not misquote us. He can remain in prison, but be productive in prison. Right. He already and made our headlines. Our interview is next on. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Stay with us. We'll be right back.